In another news, county officials in Vihiga County headquarters are expressing fear following the recent arrest of a senior Vihiga County official in connection with an ongoing corruption probe. Speaking at Vihiga County headquarters during the Governor's Scholarship Program, Vihiga County Majority Leader Manoa Mbogu expressed concerns among the chief officers and other employees of the devolved units who are pondering on who will be next on the detective's radar. Vihiga County is among the devolved units that has had numerous run-ins with the Ethics and Anti-Corruption Commission over corruption-related probes. The recent development where Noel Malanda, a county chief officer for education, was arrested on suspicion of extortion, kickbacks and other forms of corrupt conduct. <laughs> has seen county officials a worried lot. <laughs> Speaking at Vihiga County headquarters during the Governor's Scholarship Program, Vihiga County Majority Leader Manoa Mbogo says the county officers have been pondering on who will be next. So you are here in Akwoma, do a press statement and warn the ESCC to stop interfering <laughs> with the Vihiga. The majority leader appealed to the Vihiga governor, Dr. Wilberforce Otichilo, who was present to issue a statement over the continued raid by the anti-graft body in Vihiga County offices. However, the governor kept off the topic and instead concentrated on matters education. Mumesikia wanaenda Nairobi school, tukua wa alliance wako hapa, Tukua maseno university, uh, maseno wako hapa, pukona pangani girls wako hapa, maranda boys wako hapa, umeona kijana mdoko sana, ambaye anaenda Kapsabit, one of the best schools in the country. Wale wanaenda kakamega, ni wengi sana ambao wako hapa. So kulingana na mimi, hawa ni watoto ambao wakienda na waendele. Na ile bidi walikuwa nayo kwa primary school. These are clear straight A's ambao wataitimu. Wakiendelea na, na iyo ro, na iyo, na iyo bidi. Over 136 students who are joining Form 1 will have their full school fees being paid by the county. It will also include a pocket money, shopping plus transport to their various institutions. Abdiaziz Ashim for Lunchtime News.